The wife of an STX beef worker who tested positive for the coronavirus says that she and their pregnant daughter have also been infected. Sunrise reporter Jeremiah Marshall is at the Public Health District near Horn Road this morning. And Jeremiah, as you spoke with this family, did they give you a sense of how all of this happened? Yeah, Mike. Well, the wife, Rebecca Dunez, was able to tell me that her son and husband were doing some housework, but they had to stop because they weren't feeling so well. So the next day, the son decided to call into work, but the husband decided to go into work. However, he couldn't last his whole shift because his sickness was getting worse. It's heartbreaking um, to have to go through this. It's, it's devastating. Rebecca Dunia says her husband Ramiro has been an employee of STX Beef for 20 years. The plant is considered an essential business, so they are obligated to remain open. Rebecca says when her husband gotten sick, the symptoms sounded familiar. So Thursday, he still wasn't getting better. And um, I was talking to one of my friends and she told me, Becky, maybe he should call the doctor and see if they could test him for COVID-19. Ramiro was tested and his results came back positive for the coronavirus, which later affected his oxygen levels and having Ramiro spend days in ICU to fight and get better. The family was shocked, saying he took all the proper precautions but got sick anyway. Um, he had a spray, a spray bottle of bleach in his truck. He was bleaching the bottom of his shoes before he got into his truck. Um, when he went, put, went, when he went to go pump gas, he was spraying the gas pumps um, with the bleach. Rebecca then learned how an outbreak of cases came from workers from the STX beef plant and believes the virus followed him home. It was recommended that she and her children get tested. When I found out I was positive, I mean, I lost it. She, along with her daughter, who's six months pregnant, tested positive too. Fortunately, Rebecca says the two have mild symptoms, but still have to be careful yet remain hopeful. Better like he wants to see his granddaughter be born and he wants to be with his granddaughter. Um, and that's what is keeping us going. And the family says that Ramiro is out of the hospital. Now, as for the meat plant, they say they are taking extra protective measures, testing 747 employees, and out of those employees, 63 were positive for COVID-19. Reporting at the City County Health Department, Jeremiah Marshall, Chris, 6 Sunrise.